If you're going mountain climbing, don't do what this guy did. A 27-year-old student living in Japan needed to be airlifted not once, but twice while attempting to climb Mount Fuji. Initially, the student was able to reach the top of the mountain, which is just over 12,000 feet above sea level. Shortly after, he started to experience altitude sickness. Common symptoms include headaches, nausea, dizziness, and in some cases, fatigue. He made an emergency call and thankfully he was rescued, but that's not where this story ends. Days later, he decided to return to the trail and look for his phone and whatever was left behind when he got rescued. This time, another climber found him around 10,000 feet above sea level and called for emergency services after the guy couldn't move. So if you're an avid climber or you're going for the first time, the best way to avoid making the mistake this guy made is to ascend at a slower pace. If possible, try to sleep at a lower altitude, which means you would ascend during the day and then come back down and sleep at night at a lower altitude to help you acclimate better. Now, most only experience mild symptoms, which do go away after a few days. But in more severe cases, a hospital visit may be required because altitude sickness at the extreme can be deadly. We did a whole video on our channel, How to Survive, about surviving the climb of Mount Everest. Make sure to check that out and be sure to subscribe for more incredible survival stories and tips.